Hello, welcome back to uh, Imperial Splendor. It's um, mod 2.2, as I've said before. And if you remember, I said that I was going to go for the Spanish. Unfortunately, the the Portuguese have sort of become tied up in that little plot of mine, in that they are in my way, basically. So I'm going to move my um, fleet up to here and declare war on Portugal instead, basically because they've got Spain. You know, so I need I, I desperately need Madrid. What I don't need, and I've noticed that the why aren't they moving more quickly? Right, I've noticed that this is still on fire. So they've only just taken this place. There may well be a rebellion, and what I don't need is the Spanish rebel and the Portuguese to be kicked out. I need to take it from the Portuguese while the population are still unhappy. So, oh gosh, the Plains nations might join their side. I don't think. Oh, they have. Wow. Um. No, it's not the Plains Nations, it's the Ottomans. Oh no, they've refused to join. Right, nobody's joined the um, Portuguese side, so OK, I need to make peace with the Ottomans again afterwards, it looks like. So, right, oh, whoops, let's get these out of here then. See how far we can get them. Not very far, because I've got the guns with them. I was going to wait, but then when I saw the fire up there, I decided to go in right away. So, let's get as close as we can, and I don't know. Just so long as we can get them, come on, speed up. So long as we can get them on a, oh, I can't see what's in there. What a pain! Yeah, I was about to say, as so long as we can get them where we're attacking them, and they're just defending, then they should stand there while my uh, mortars pummel them. And I'm hoping by going for Madrid instead of Lisbon, um, the populace will be unhappy with the Portuguese, um, and therefore I won't have any resistance to foreign occupation to deal with. That's the general plan anyway, but we'll see. I don't suppose those ships can get back anywhere, really. Not this turn, they can't, no. Right, OK, now the other thing I wanted to do was bring some troops over from here. Um, I don't suppose the guns are going to be able to make it, but I'm going to bring a couple anyway, just in case. So if I get... Uh, so I don't know what moves quicker, guns or mortars or what, really. Um... I don't suppose any of these are going to be able to get anywhere, to be quite honest. Yeah, I really don't. But anyway, what have I got there? I've got four in there. Um, and I've got another one there. Five. I think you might be getting an army together. Um, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that's ten that can get to the port. Oh, they can actually. They can reach. Oh, no, that does surprise me. Oh, no, we can't because we can't go through there. Because, you know, although we're allied. I think that I'd end up declaring war on them. In fact, that's not even my port. That's their port. <laughs> what am I doing? That's their port. Right, OK. I need to get to my port, which is over here. I'm really surprised that I can walk through that land there. Spain, I know I can. I didn't think I could go through Gino and land. Uh, in fact, I'm pretty sure I can't. But if it says I can, then I can. So, and yes, we can. Wow. That really surprised me. Okay, right. Um, now, ships from over here. I don't think I need all of them. I, think I just need a brig, perhaps, into there to pick them up next turn. And then we'll get those over to perhaps attack Madrid or something like that. So I don't know whether I can get any guns to reach. You see, then, I don't think they're even going to get to the port in time, you know, to go with the rest of the army. They're not, are they? They're miles away. So now I'm going to have to leave the guns behind on this one. We're going to have to attack... Um, Lisbon with no guns, which is going to be a bit of a pain. Let me just check where the guns are in Morocco, where they're going to. So I've got a couple of mortars in here, haven't I? So maybe they should be heading towards the port. Might be wise. And these perhaps towards the port now. Him too, maybe. Get another little army going there. And then him. Oh, they're already going into there anyway, so... Uh, I don't know now what to do. I've got loads and loads of money to spend. What do I spend that money on? Where can I get an army? Um, I'm tempted to hold on to it, actually, so that I can repair all the buildings in here when I take it. These don't need replenishing, do they? No, they don't. Right. Uh, uh, OK, I'm not going to raise any more, because it's just going to cost me money. I want to try and do this with my existing army if I can, so... Um, I can't remember what state these are in. Whoops, not those. Morocco. What have we got then? Minus six. 
I don't think I need to exempt them this turn. In fact, I'm pretty sure I don't need to. I think it's going to be next turn. So, OK, let's see what happens then. Right. First turn end. I'm expecting about five turn ends on here. That's where my army came from there, of course. Um, I'm not returning them. So, right. OK. Uh, Ottomans. Now, they're the ones who stopped being my friends, weren't they? So, um, I don't think they actually declared war or anything, though, did they? So... Ah, now they're at war with Russia, so that could be good news for me, because it means I've got somebody occupying them, doesn't it? So, Right, hmm, okay. Genoa look like they are just being friendly, just being allies and hanging around my cities to protect them. Let's hope that's the case. But it doesn't look like, well, they haven't, I was going to say, it doesn't look like the Portuguese have attacked me, does it? So, they certainly haven't done. So, right, let's demand Morocco. Yeah, we expected that. Oh dear, it's going to be a sneeze. <laughs> Oh, right, sorry about that, I don't know if you heard that or not, it's just a couple of sneezes jumped in there, so, right, let's demand, that's Morocco, isn't it, so, right, uh, the Dragoons need to get back into here, what I should maybe have done was got a, a ship in here, you know, that I could have brought these troops out, couldn't I, but I don't think they can all get in anyway yet, actually, before moving those out, I should have checked, do you know, he might have made all the difference, just that one in there, uh, what a pain, Right, OK. Well, those over to here. Well, they're certainly not going to make any difference. Oh, what about them? They might be able to. I wonder. Minus one. But I can only... I can get three in there. Those three should tip the balance, shouldn't they, really? I wonder if it's worth doing that. Um, I wonder. Uh. Uh, yeah, I think I might try it, because it would mean that I can get my money from there, wouldn't it? No. No. I'm better off just recruiting one Dragoon in the... Oh, I can't get Dragoons. Oh, in that case, I'm going to have to. OK, all three of those into there. And let's hope that it settles them, and it hasn't done. What a waste. So I have to do that anyway. OK. I right. blew it there, but... Let's see what happens over here. I haven't got any ships for them anyway at the moment, so... What have we got in here? Right. Oh, wow, look at that. Nothing at all. No supporting armies. Nothing. Oh, wow, that's mine. Oh, do you know, they're even... They are. I was going to say, they're even going to surrender. Look at... Oh, now there it is. Ah, now can I fight an army like... I don't need to, do I? I've got my troops coming on, haven't I? My new troops. Hmm. Okay, right. Well, let's um, repair all these places then. Yeah, remember I said I wasn't going to spend my money. It's probably just as well. I want to repair all of these. I want to be able to recruit in here. And I think I'll be able to... Yes, I can. I can recruit the goons in there, can't I? So that's what I'm going to have to do. But I'm just going to have to hold off any attack that comes in from here because I can't recruit anything in here at the moment, can I? So, right. Region captured Spain. Excellent. Uh, workers on strike Morocco, we know about that, I've dealt with all those. Letters of Demand, Vene Venetia. Oh, they're OK. Ah, so I don't need to worry about them. Uh, workers on strike, Venetia. Right. It's interesting, isn't it? That's because of all those troops I've just taken out, of course. Right. What were those, actually? Are they all dragoons? Oh, they're Karazias. Do you know, I could have taken those Karazias out as well. They'd have been more useful to me than the uh, infantry that I took out. What a pain. Right, OK. Workers on strike, that's Venetia. Uh, letter of demand, Venetia, we know about that. Yeah, we've seen all these. Right, OK, that one as well, Morocco. Uh, new town emerges in Ireland. Right. Did it say Ireland, then? Oh, it is Ireland. Right, OK. Um, well, I'm getting places that are going to make more money for me, so... And then over here, technologies have failed. Well, let's go in there and try again. So... 
Mm, what did I say I was going to get? I was going to get Division of Labour, wasn't I? That's the plan, anyway, so I can improve my ports. Right, all oh, good. Um, built some more buildings. Constructed some more buildings, I ought to say, really. It makes better English, doesn't it? Right, there it is. That's what I'm looking for. I knew there'd be something like that in there, so let's get rid of that one. Good. Well, place is settled anyway, but I want to bring my troops out, you see. That's the, the problem. Um, now, can I get those troops over from here to somewhere useful? Oh, do you know, I could have been replenishing those as well last turn, couldn't I? That's another oversight. Getting laps at this. Very laps. It's unacceptable. So, right, OK, those onto there. And Navy over to... I don't know where yet. Into here, then over to there um, to support my um, my troops in Spain. Or do I bring them straight over for an attack on... Oh, well, there's your answer straight away. Oh, no, they're allied. It's these, isn't it? Oh, it's Spain. Hey, do you know, I can. I can get all the way through. Oh, no, I can't because I can't reach. Um, I, what I was thinking, you see, was that I could get um, all the way into here with those ten units. In fact, I'm still thinking it. Because I can leapfrog them from here, can't I? Uh, yes, I can. Let's just check the troops are definitely on there. Yes, they are. Right, OK. And then over to here. Right. Um... OK, out from there, and then the ship that's left in there, good, will have the troops on... No, he hasn't. So weird's happened. Where's the ship I had in there? I can't tell which one has got the troops on, but it should be this one. And it is. Oh, that's OK then. Good. Now, what I have to think about is how I can land my troops. Oh, and I can. Look at that. Where's that um, Portuguese navy gone to? Well, it doesn't matter. It's vanished. So, let's go into it. Because that's mine, you see, now, because I've taken Spain. Right. And troops from there out to here. Good. Now, I'm going to replenish these as well, because I think they might need it. OK, and then, from here, maybe I should get to... Well, in fact, no, before I do that, let's get my dragoons in here. I want to get a load of dragoons up here. Oh, no, I know I can't get them yet, can I? Damn. And I've only got 262 left anyway. So, OK, well, that's the end of it. I can't move any more than that, because I'm replenishing those troops. And I think that's the way it should be, replenishing them anyway. It would have been so nice to be able to get um, a ship in there, though, to pick up those mortars, wouldn't it? It'd be rather nice to have a couple of mortars to add to what I've got from everywhere else. But, OK, can't do it, so shouldn't moan about it. But I wonder if that ship there can get down to here. It can. Right, well, I don't need it up there anymore, so let's have it down here so that he can pick some more people up when the time comes. It would be lovely if I could get those over to there. I don't think I'm ever going to utilise them, to be honest with you. I really don't, because I think they're going to hold up my progress too much. And if anything, it's going to be these that are on their way over there, isn't it, in the first place. So, OK, right, let's do a turn and see what happens. Um, like I said, if you remember, when I took Morocco, it was all about having launch areas so that we could take Spain. What's he asking for there? No, you're not... New Mexico? Why doesn't he want Madrid? He wants New Mexico. Oh, no, hang on. They're going to give New Mexico. They're going to give me the region, New Mexico, for a trade agreement. Wow, they are so desperate. Why do they want to give me New Mexico? Well, I think that they are so struggling, aren't they? I wonder if it's because it borders on with the Plains Nations. Who am I at war with now that's Indian? Uh, allies, trade partners, um, protectorates. Allies, trade partners, enemies, right. Denmark and Portugal, that's all Denmark and Portugal. I wonder if it's because the Portuguese are, oh, I'm going to accept anyway. So, uh, yeah, we'll have that. We'll take New Mexico, thank you very much. Don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I'll take it.
I'm deeply suspicious about that. Were they offering New Mexico or demanding it from me? Because I don't think I've got New Mexico, have I? Um, I'm going to have to double check that one. I don't think I read that one properly. I'm pretty sure I don't have New Mexico. Or I didn't have, anyway. Uh, it did look like an offer, didn't it? An offer of New Mexico. Right. right it's not going to go over to the Americas now, is it? Ah, now that's the Spanish. He's just fought the Spanish. I wonder why my ships didn't come out to help them. Oh, he's going for raiding the trade route. And he's moving his troops back to Lisbon. I wonder if I can get to Lisbon before his troops do. Ah, that would be good, wouldn't it? Uh, I'm not worried about his troops being in Lisbon, to be honest. Uh, so long as... I can pound him with some artillery. Uh, it doesn't matter to me if they're phylocarm citizenry or whatever they are, you know. Okay, enemy trade route. Right, building constructed, thank you. Um, public servant dies. Which one's that? Uh, is it one of my ministers? Yeah, it's him, isn't it? That's, hang on, isn't that the second time I've had to replace him in very quick succession? <laughs> okay, um, who can I... A tactician, no, not generally. Go cool, look at that lot. Tends to be navy, that one. Honest. Management. Lower classes. Minus three, clamour for reform. He looks good, doesn't he? Management of army. But I think he's the one for me. That looks good, doesn't it? Uh, yeah, I think we'll go for that. That might even help with Morocco, actually. Public servant dies. Oh, what's this one? Technology theft failed. Well, let's get him back in there, then. Uh, over to there, and we're taking, hopefully, Division of Labour. Thank you very much. And new port emerges in Spain. Do you know, I'm tempted not to do anything with that quite yet, because it might attract him to come... No, I, I will, actually. No, I will. Now I think about it. Because if it does attract him to come and attack me, that could be a good thing for me. Now, over here, new town emerges. New Mexico. So I did. I got New Mexico. It's extraordinary, isn't it? Why did I get New Mexico? Um, are they ha they're happy as well. I don't quite understand this. Why would he give me New Mexico? Isn't this somewhere that the Plains nations normally have or something? I'm not sure. I could lose this place, but hey-ho, there you go. It's um, uh, religious unrest. I think that's what I need to work on more than anything, isn't it? So let's give them um, a church then in here. Right. I don't understand why he's done that for a trade agreement. All that's done is give me another territory. Where's this? Bavaria? Oh, well, that's going to be... Um, uh, they're happy, aren't they? So that's going to be another uh, craft workshop. Ah, running out of money. Now, that is a pain. What have we got here? Lightning is electricity. OK, thank you very much for that wonderful revelation. Now, the big problem is I've run out of money and... Ah, and our income has gone down vastly. I was hoping to get a load of... Dragoons in here, um, not in there, in Madrid, so that I could then just leave the place and go and attack over there. But I don't have any money left, and I don't quite know why my income went down so much. What, what's Madrid doing then? Is it uh, not Madrid, New Mexico? Is it taxable? No tax. It's not receiving any income. Why would that? No one who's given it to me. There's no income at all. How can you have a place with no income whatsoever? That's bizarre. Um, right, what does this say? Does it say towns are growing or anything? No villages... There are no villages left. And it has no income. Right, that's a bit bizarre, isn't it? Um, uh, I think I know why he's given me that. It is totally and absolutely useless. Look at that. Is that a blip or something? I mean, it should have these things going for it, shouldn't it? <sighs> right, OK. I think we've picked up a white elephant there, I'm afraid. Um, right, we've got trade back with Spain. We're in here. I have no guns. And I have no idea what he's got in there. 
No idea at all. And if I go in and attack there, I can't support them with troops from here, or can I? Do you know I can? Um, I think it might be in my interest to attack him this turn. Because he's out of the way, isn't he? He's all the way up there. Uh, can I get in there and take him? Be interesting to see how many troops he's actually got in there, won't it? I think I'm going to have to do it, you know, to wipe them out, and then I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Zero tax it or something. I, I don't know. I'll we'll have to do something. So, right, okay, I can reach. In the meantime, anyway, I'm going to go through there first, because that's a road, and that will enable me to see exactly what he's got in there. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He's only got ten in there, and I've got ten as well. But if I supplement them with some more troops from elsewhere, if I put those in there... Right, and continue siege, and then bring these over in support, I might just make it, you know. Um, they can actually get almost all the... They can actually reach, you know, them. That's, that's amazing. Can they as well? They can almost get there, you know, those. Right, well, let's send in the general and these. Uh, I don't know where they go through. It looks like they go through there, doesn't it? But I'm not sure if the road actually goes through there or not. I don't think it does. Well, whether it does or not, I'm going to go into here with the expectation I can join that army. I think that will shorten my route to join them. And if I can get Portugal out of this game quickly, then that's very much what I need to do. Right, so I now have 13 in there, and OK, some of them are still replenishing. Can I get the foot in there? I think maybe they're just going to come along afterwards, aren't they? Um, they're not quite going to reach, but they might come on as reinforcements, so it's definitely worth giving that a try, I think. Okay. Oh, look, they can actually reach. Oh, that's amazing. Right, so what have I got in there now? I've actually got two, four, I've actually got 15 in there now. Now, some of them are, are smaller units. Um, can I move these through as well? Can I get any of these through? Um, hmm... Funny, isn't it? These can move further than the Dragoons. Why is that? I don't quite understand that. They've got a very good movement range, those guys, haven't they? <laughs> um, right, well, I, I think it's going to be a case of trying to take that, isn't it? Because if I take that now, then... Oh, do you know, if only I could get those guns in there as well. I, d I can't risk it. I think he can come and attack me from there. I think he would be able to reach... I don't know what sort of army he's got... He's only got... he's got infantry in there. He hasn't got any guns, so he's going to move at the speed of the infantry. Can he reach? Uh, not quite... I don't think he can quite reach. But I think he can almost get there. Now, the thing is, if I can get my guns and my extra general up there in support of that army there... In other words, if I just drop them, say, here... Because uh, I'm not sure they'll make it from the port. If I drop them in the port, will they then be able to reach here? I don't think so. It would expose them, wouldn't it? What I'd have to do is drop them off here. And then hope that we can... Uh, that he doesn't attack me this turn. I think that's going to be it. I might be giving away my ships here, you know. <laughs> but it means I can get him next turn. So let's go for it. Those on to there. Navy up to here, which is about the nearest I can get, about there. Right, okay, now let's see if I can get my army to join this army. See how close they can get. Ah, uh, they go the other side. Damn. Okay. Uh, right, let's see if I can drop them there. I can. Now, can they get safe somewhere? Can they get back to safety? Oh, look, they can. All the way. That's pretty good. Okay, now... I've now got two generals in there. One... well, I've got one coming on in reserve. I don't suppose these are going to be able to join, are they? No. They get close, though. They do get closer. Hmm. be interesting to see, actually, if they can attack there... And then the others can join in the attack. No, they can't. 
No, okay, so he's got to attack me this turn, hasn't he, really? So, I ha haven't got any money left anyway, so I can't really do anything else. Morocco, I think, is... Oh, it's yellow anyway. I don't think I can f tax them, can I? No, I can't. And I can't afford to get anybody else in there, so... it's. I think what's taking my money away is, is these ships here. But then that's been good for me, because it's enabled me to get into position, hasn't it? Hey, look, I'm only 25 minutes as well. Um, I might just be able to attack and take Lisbon on this same video. That would be a great result, wouldn't it? It really depends on whether the the Portuguese come out and attack me this turn. I suspect they will, but I haven't got any guns or anything, have they? Now, I know my guns can't come on in support, but if he moves that army over to Lisbon and then comes out to attack me from Lisbon, they may well just come on in support. So he might have two armies together attacking me. Now, I think these go in alphabetical order, don't they? Um, so after O should be P, really, before Russia. But it's going straight to Russia. So I can't remember what order it goes in, but um, maybe maybe it's in order of um, ascendancy in, in terms of you know who the most powerful nations are or something. I really don't know. I don't know. Or maybe it's just a, the their starting order and Portugal starts low down the list. I really don't know. But anyway, the point is, I'm, I'm just trying to find out if Portugal have decided what to do. Really, you know, so see if it's gone past them or not. Because it's a perfect result for me if it hasn't gone past them. Because I'm going to add those mortars to my army, and then I'm going to pound him into dust, aren't I? In uh, in Lisbon, and I'm hardly going to lose any troops either. That will be a, a cracking result for me. Right. Of course, one thing I haven't considered is that he might be able to get back to Madrid. Um, I didn't check if he had the range to get back to attack Madrid. In fact, I didn't even check how happy Madrid were. Um, I think they were on yellow, but I didn't do a special check of it. Now, here they come. Now. Oh, is that me? Did I leave an army in there? A navy in there? That wasn't clever. Can I retreat? Oh no, I needed to repeat in, retreat into a port. Ah, now that's good for me. Do you see that? He's moved his army to the port. And that's the end of the Portuguese move. So that means he's lost. That's Portugal out of the game because I'm simply going to pound him in Lisbon. Well, I'm, I'm a bit sorry about that really because I was rather hoping, um, expecting really, to go in without guns. Um, and that would mean it would be a proper pitched battle um, that you could watch. But unfortunately in this one, it's going to be a case of standing off at a distance, I'm afraid, again, and pounding him into dust. OK, building constructed, thank you very much. And it's late at night, so it means I probably won't have a chance to finish this, which is a damn nuisance. So, OK, join those to there. Right, and then they're going to have to attack, but let's see what we do with the rest of these first. Theft failed. Him into there, and steal this. Right, OK. Now, one thing I'm a bit worried about is that I won't have time to do this battle. Let's hope. Because um, it's going to take a long time pounding him. Maybe I'm going to have to fight. I'll pound him and then and then maybe go and do a bit of fighting as well at the end. But uh, these are all just militia. In fact, they're irregulars, in fact. They're not even... What are they? It says irregulars. Melissa's... Or something. I don't know, Miraculous? Or, or, I don't know what they are. Anyway, it's a lot of phylic armed citizenry um, that are going to shoot at me from a distance. He's got 19 units. I need to count those down as I destroy them. I suppose these guns can reach, can they? Of course they can't. Silly idea. Right, OK. Here's Lisbon for the taking. And I'll show you the result, folks. If anything interesting happens, I'll bring you back in. But you know what happens to these things. He's got no chance. He's just going to get pummeled to death, isn't he? OK, see you in a second. Well, this has been raging on for um, several hours, um, and we still have this unit here hanging around, and we don't seem to be able to get it to disappear. It was 43 about 20-odd um, minutes ago, ago, and it's now 27, so um, I think we're going to have to go in there and get them, so uh, let's um, start advancing. Uh, this could take a while to do, so let's get in some kind of a position where we can at least be threatening. I think what's going to happen is some fusiliers or whatever are going to appear. I'm going to speed this up a little bit, um, just to around about there, um, because I really am expecting that 
some units. Can you see this, by the way, here? Um, it's well in my favour at the moment, but um, you can sort of imagine I've got eight units to his two, and I've obviously got 18 units, so I think there are probably about three full units still hidden in there somewhere. So we're going to inch forward and see what we can get into. So um, I do think we're going to meet them fairly soon. Um, right, OK, I've got a horse over here as well. And we'll get those to follow up. In fact, it might be an idea to just, you know, put them all in a in a group and leave the artillery behind. That makes the most sense, doesn't it? So, OK, those up to there. So he's still there, isn't he? What is he now? He's still 37. I don't know what it is. It's something about um, that unit that's hard to hit. And I think it's just that... Yeah, there has to be something that encourages me to um, continue to attack rather than just shell him from a distance, I imagine, anyway. So, is that all the horses? Let me just speed that up just a little bit more. OK, almost there. Yep, I think we're there. Artillery's still firing, of course. So if I do a control a which is the entire army, take out the CO. I'm going to leave him behind. Um, oh, and this CO and take out the guns, right, and then form them there into a group, then I ought to be able... Hope, did I get that right? Uh, it looks to me as though I formed the COs into a group there. Um, I'll try that again. Um, something went wrong there. Let's just get rid of that group. Ungroup. Right, OK. Um, perhaps I should choose them individually. One, two, three, hang on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, into a group. I think I got them all this time, haven't I? Um, horse, 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 yep, I think that's about right. OK, good. Well, let's advance the group then. And get them going anyway to start with. How many has he got there? I bet it's still 37, isn't it? Yeah, 37. It's taken forever to get him from, well, 43 down to 37. So, But I, I really do think there are other troops hidden amongst this scrub. Or, I don't, I don't know, perhaps woodland. I think I'm being kind calling it woodland. I think it's really scrub. Um, OK. Ah. Now, that's a big clue. When you get some broken ground like that, it usually... Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, I told you, didn't I? Let me just pause that for a moment. And... Instead of going where I just said, I'm going to go to... And this is where it's difficult, you see. Um, I don't really want to go all that way. What I want to do is just go part way. So, oh, crikey, oh, that's bad. About to there, I think. Maybe even... Yeah, just there. You see where he's positioned his troops? Just where the terrain breaks. Yeah? And, of course, now we're exposing flanks, which is not good. Right. OK, see what's going on? Um, just at the point where it's the most difficult point for me to pass, that's where his um, his army's appeared. But, uh, anyway, let's go down to a normal speed now. That's the reason why I paused, really, because I'm going too fast to be able to manage it without normal speed. I think these are my regular line. Yeah, they are. They're, they're doing folly fire. You should find that my uh, guard troops, which are these... Oh, they're not even firing, are they? Um, are any of them firing? No. None of them are firing. They're not, they're not within range at all. I could bring them round so they can fire, but I suspect what will happen then um, is that something else will appear on the flank there. So, 29 out of 40... Ah, oh, we should be able to cope with that. 131 on there, though. 
I wonder if it might be worth breaking off one horse unit to just take those out. What about these here? Yeah, they're a good unit, aren't they? So let's get those into the diamond formation. And we'll charge those into the flank of that decent unit that he's got there. Um, is he still on 37? Oh, he's 34 now. You never know, there might be a chance we might reduce them significantly. A little bit of luck. So, why are we on here? 150, 150, 150. Crikey. Looks like he isn't hitting anybody, doesn't it? So, are we in a position yet? Oh, crikey. That's going to take a while, isn't it? Um, I wonder, actually, if it's worth running them. Yeah, I think it might be. Okay. Well, I think we're in a position now to hit the flank. Let's give it a try. 114. Hmm. What I need to do, really, is find out which troops are in line with them and stop them firing when the time comes. Uh, and I think it's going to... oh, what's happening now? I don't seem to... oh yes, right, okay. But those as well, yeah, I think it's those as well, actually, isn't it? Oh look, see those? Just appeared. Naughty. Right, okay, oh, I've got another unit. Is it here? Let's get those charging those then, shall we? Look at that, it's a full unit, and now we've got these as well. See what I mean? Loads of units appearing all of a sudden. Now, draw them back. Right, okay. Um, damn, is that my horse or is that him? No, he's gone. Right, well, let's get my chaps back over here. Um, because it's exposed all of these units over here, isn't it? So, uh, ah, now other units are appearing as well. And it did look as so though the battle was over, didn't it? So, let's see, where have we Ah, right, okay, they're gone. That's good. And, um,. Over here, it looks like they're outranging us, doesn't it? Oh yeah, there we go, it's armed citizenry again, isn't it? It's very naughty of them, isn't it? But uh, what are they, armed citizenry as well? Right, okay, well I'm just going to go in and charge those, because they're not particularly good troops. So we might as well just take them away. Uh, we'll take them away with these as well. Yep, and these, I think I've got some guard amongst these as well, you know. So we should easily be able to clear all of those away. This is what I don't like about the Firelock Arm citizenry, that, that sort of extra range and how difficult it is to clear them away. So I'm going to get all of these to go and attack those and just hope that there isn't some other unit hidden at the back there. I don't expect there will be. What are they? They're foot... oh, they're fusiliers actually. So let's get my horse to the side here and we might be able to just hit their flank. That might improve things slightly. Um, looks like they might be trying to get away. I think what they're trying to do is get a shot on the horse. Yeah, knowing that that's the sort of maximum impact target for them. So, okay, we have their flank. So, now we go. Ah, look at that. That's platoon fire, isn't it? Firing from there and yeah, that's definitely platoon fire. I think we have them now, hopefully. Do we? Um, all gone, all gone. Um, I think... Is that it? So how on earth... Is he still standing? What, what's happening at the back here? Let's have a look at these. Let's see what's going on. See if there's anybody... Ah, right now, okay. What have we got here? These, I think... Are oh no! No, no, we've got these! Ah, now what are these? Aha, we have some fairly decent troops here, so let's chase the horse into them. The decent horse, and those, and these, and these. Okay citizenry those, aren't they? So, um, can't even see them. Are they on the way? 
Uh, right, okay, they're outside the range, so I'm going to leave those. Um, it looks like they've gone anyway, doesn't it? But um, I wonder if it's actually... Ah, stop the guns. Forgot about those. Right. Okay, let's see how effective they are against horse. Um. Ah, not too good. Down to 12. Right, okay. Anybody else needs to be hit? Has anybody else appeared? No, that's it. Good. Well, that's Lisbon. Um, okay, I'm going to go onto the battle map, repair the buildings and replenish the troops, probably, but I need to see what resources I've got first. But um, anyway, there's no point in really going back to it, is there? You know, I've now taken Lisbon, and you know that... Um, oh, in fact, no, I'll show you, actually, because um, you need to know, or well, I certainly need to know anyway, that, that uh, Portugal are definitely out of the game. It looks like we're almost there, actually, are we? They shall be guillotined. No, they're not talking about British bankers. Um, it's a good idea, though. Well, it's an interesting idea. Um, what have we got? 243 lost. Hmm, I shouldn't really have lost that many, should I? But, okay. Take it on the chin. What have we got? Region captured, good, and nation destroyed. Excellent. That's exactly what we wanted. Oh, failed. I thought I'd dealt with that already, but perhaps not. Um, where is he? Uh, right. Okay, um... Oh, I thought it said failed, then. Obviously missed something there, but, um, over... To, well, I say over. Back to Portugal. And... Repair. I think I should be able to repair all of these... Oh, no, I can't. Ah, in that case... Oh, damn. That's not good. Um, I need to repair these. OK, that'll do. I'll just repair those two for now, and if there's a university there, or a college, or whatever... Yeah, there's one. Let's get rid of that as well. And how many minuses are we? Uh, minus 18, oh dear. This could take quite a while to settle, but Madrid is settled and I can produce uh, dragoons there, so... Okay, need to think about what to spend the extra money on, and it does look like we might just um, have a good anchor on to Spain. Okay, anyway, thanks for watching folks, and... Uh, I think Spain is more than likely going to be the next target. Let's hope so.